ask you as me but who do you think you are opening this book when the cover clearly says do not open this book if a sign on a book reads do not enter do you enter of course you don't the least you would do is knock first the reason you are not supposed to open this book is because it is not yet written look at this blank page look at this jumble of words caution thinking in progress you think it's easy to put words together <gasps> Now go away. I need time to think. Now what? Can't you see I'm busy? I'm trying to decide what type of story to write. Perhaps I will write a scary story. Or maybe a bedtime story. After you go to sleep, I will be able to get to work. Work. Even if you are snoring, it will be better than having you stare at me. Arg! Why are you still here? Okay, I have an idea. If you sit very still and are very quiet, I will try to work while you are watching me. But please, no matter what you do, do not turn pages while I am working. Page turning during story writing can cause words to blow around and they might end up in the wrong order. Okay, here I go. I am starting my story. A ferocious storm swept through the forest. A tiny mouse hid beneath a pink flower. A tiger paced and flashed its big sharp teeth trying to take a bite of the roaring wind oof big ferocious mouse splashed sharp pink teeth i warn you about what might happen if you turn the pages now you see how careful you have to be with words This time I am going to make sure you do not turn the page. I have to tell you again, do not turn the page. Oh, you are very strong. Do you work out at a gym? Okay, I give up. Since you won't go away, I will make this story about you. What's your name? Oh, I cannot spell that. Hmm, I will tell you what. I will leave a blank line this. So, whenever you see a blank line in the story, say your name. Ready? Okay, now you can turn the page. There once was a giant pest named Anna. Anna had huge eyes, humongous ear and too many teeth. Also a big nose it didn't matter how many times Anna was asked to go away. Anna would not go. Finally, I had to call the giant pest control company. Hello, I said. I am on page 29 of an unwritten book and a giant pest named Anna will not stop bothering me. I cannot work and I cannot stand this for another second. So please send someone right away to help me get rid of Anna. Egg, egg, egg! You are still here. I thought my story would make you so mad you would slam this book shut and go away. Don't you have anything better to do? Maybe you could go bother someone else. Maybe you could go wash your toenails grow. Oh, look, I am almost out of pages. Wow, I wrote a whole book. It was pretty good, too, wasn't it? 
The part with the big ferocious mouse was scary. So in a way it was a scary story. It was a bedtime story too because I am certainly very tired. <gasps> I am going to sleep now. Goodbye and oh hmm thank you for helping me write this book. I couldn't have done it without you. Now go away. Good night. Caution. Sleep in progress. The end.